Hi there, this is Smart Penguins and we're here to help you with your game making adventures. This video will demonstrate how you can create the simple way for a character to walk into the water, swim in water and then walk out. How our scene is set up is we have static colliders for our ground and we have a static collider for our water. The collider for our water is below the water level, so when the character enters the water he continues to walk on the collider, but we can play a swim animation. How the character is set up, our character has two states, walk and run. We use the run animation for demonstrate swimming. You can replace it with your swim animation. The two states, we have slower move speed for walk and we have faster move speed for run. Then we have two if colliders. If we collide with run, we switch to walk state. If we collide with water, we switch to run state. The if collider for a character a little bit below our dynamic collider for to make sure that we get a trigger if we collide with something. And let's demonstrate it again. Our character enters the water and starts swimming. Collides with the ground and starts walking. We created this video for an answer to a form question on buildbox.com but we decided to publish it. Maybe it's going to be helpful for someone else. The solution is not perfect for every scenario but it's a good simple way of doing it. Thank you for watching. If you want to see more tutorials subscribe to our channel.